Hey guys, it's Stacy from Misguided Road Trips, and tonight you're not going to believe this, but I am filming with Clay from Time to Play TV. Hi. Patty from the G Team. Hi. And Heather from Heather's Honings with the G Team. Hi. And Clayton was nice enough to bring us to the Drowning House, so we're going to go in here now. There was a mom who um, supposedly drowned her two children in the bathtub. I don't really know a lot more about the story than that, but he did pick up some um, voices when he was here before. So tonight we're going to come back with Spirit Box and we're going to see if we can find out anything. So come on. Thanks. Okay. Taking them in. Clay's being the spider blocker. I'm going second because. He was a gentleman and told us we could go through the window, but I don't think I'm going through the window material. Oh. All right, guys, so here we go inside the house. Nobody has been in this house for a long time. Wow. I already thought I heard something. What'd you see? It's completely just ran down. Oh, yeah, look at the vines everywhere. <laughs> Trying scary, ain't it? He's already seen a spider. All right, Patty says, Don't touch the walls. There's black widows. What is that hole for? It's kind of weird, guys. Just a random square hole. Maybe since this was the kitchen, they passed the food through the window. You seen some? Yes. Watch out for rats, too. We saw, like, two rats while we were here last night. Oh, gosh, I hate rats. Now you tell us. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Eight legs to hug you with. Hmm. <laughs> This room, the ceiling has all oh, fell apart. It says eight legs to hug you with. It's a spider. Spider motel vacancy. Mm -hmm. Girls are exploring. They're exploring all the spiders. I'm watching out for spiders. I'm scared of them. Oh my god. Why don't they tear this place down? Look at this. Dead and alone. I don't know. So the hole in the kitchen comes out to the closet. That's kind of weird. I guess this was the front door, guys. Ah. It smells like. Yeah, I can smell it too. It does smell like it something smell died. Like dead. Oh my god, guys. Mm. That's horrible. Have you guys really searched the property to make sure there's like not anything dead out here? I mean, yeah. Oh, it's so weird. Thank you. So I appreciate that. Don't go far back there. You'll see. The floor's caving down. You'll see it, though. Okay. All right, guys. So we're going to go rest. upstairs. And, uh, yeah. 
I'm having to make sure I'm not putting my hand on any spider webs as I crawl up these steps. Clay is staying with me. So, wow, yeah, you can definitely tell where the floor is falling through. through. mattress over there. Okay guys, I'm not sure what is going on. This is the third battery I have put in here showing dead. This is the stairs. Old mattress. And there's the attic, but I'm kind of scared to walk on that floor. As you can see that it's sloping down. Not very safe. Thought I heard something. I know we have to walk over there and see this old pump house to it and then there's a garage did y'all go in here Patty yeah yeah it was pretty creepy yeah um so So when we were over here, we just seen a rat. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, I kicked the board inside of here and scared the shit out of my <laughs> Okay. They said there's lots of rats in here. I'm not going in because it does look like a haven for rats. Let me know if y'all see any. And if you do, keep him with y'all. Oh, vines just growing everywhere. This is the window with the face? Yeah, right there. Oh. I can see it on my camera a little bit. Yeah. You got it on yours? Oh. See it? Oh my gosh. Yeah. I see a face. Do you guys see that? Like right, right there. there. Whoa, what the hell? Yep. Do you see wow. this one? Come look at my camera. I have it zoomed in. I really okay. do see a freaking. What do you... Oh. See it? Oh my gosh, I see that. That's the same place I'm seeing it. Like something. Or something creepy. I mean, look, it's like awful. it's looking Look, I can, it's on mine too. And we're at different angles. So it can't be like. The dust and all on the windows right. from the different angles. Isn't that cool though? That's crazy. Wow. So yeah, so like there's this face that just pops up when you're looking at this window. That is crazy, guys. Oh, I see it. If there's anybody out there who wishes to speak to us, you can talk to our cameras and we can hear you when we get home. You won't go. Yeah, 
big field back there, guys. I know you can't really see it on my camera too well, but it is open back there. And the wind's blowing that moss around, so it's really kind of creepy out here tonight. There's another house back there that's abandoned. Oh, wow. The drowning house. How the hell did you spot that? Wow. They just realized there's another house back here. That's amazing. Check out this house that they just, or maybe it's a barn. There's hi. And hey, look at all the sandspers on my damn boots. Oh, no. oh yeah, oh, you got shit. some. Oh my God, there's all the sandspurs on my boots. Oh yeah, y'all are bad. Let I'm not bad. <laughs> yep, it's part of what we do. Oh, this is so cool. Now I have a spot that'll babysit my doggy while I have to work. There you go. Bring them here and put some food and water. I was thinking about my kids. <laughs> Just joking, guys. I would never lock my kids up like that. <laughs> Somebody would say, Stacy's going to lock her kids in that old dilapidated barn. It's going to be that way. Those things were so horrible. Mm-hmm. I wish I'd have got that on film. What's that? Oh, okay. with him doing Yeah, that. doing the cobwebs. <laughs> Anybody here? Speak to us. Yep, there's a three bales of hay. Apologize, it's so dark out here. You aren't going to be able to see much with the lighting. It'll only carry so far. Anyway, even with a really good camera, it's nighttime. But now, if y'all hear anything, that's an ant bed. If y'all hear anything or see anything, y'all let me know. I really haven't heard or seen much, but um, that doesn't mean it's not happening. We saw the face in the window, which was pretty cool. Something sound like something hit something or something, but I thought it was you. I thought it was you guys messing with me, but you were too far away. <laughs> that's, what inside of that. yeah, no. that's crazy. Oh my god. What the hell was that? It's coming from over that way. Is somebody out here? 
Okay, that was weird. Heather's talking about hearing a rat or something, and then we hear something else. But we just searched there. That's the building um, where the face was at in the window. But I don't know what it was we heard. And then over here is another building. Did that come from there or there? It almost sounded like it came from the one you're in front of. Me either. <clears throat> Whatever that was, I thought it sounded yeah, like it came from here. I noticed that the walls were all bowed out. Yeah. I don't think it'd be real safe to go into. Yeah. I don't like know. You said, we might be savage, but we ain't stupid. That's right. Our new shirts. We savage, but we ain't stupid. Yeah, see. Yeah, look at that. That's all messed up in there. That is fine. Wow. Hmm. Probably was a very pretty place at one time. Obviously, they had a lot of property out here. And I guess somebody still comes out and collects the hay off the fields. Kind of misty out here tonight. I don't know, guys. Y'all seen it here. This was a drowning house with another story is drowned her two babies. Um, it's a horrible story, it really is. I don't know anything else I can say about it other than that is what we've been told. But, um, it does give you a kind of strange feeling knowing that that could have happened here. So, okay guys, we're heading back into the house, which is for some reason really blurry and of course Clayton says watch for rats and I'm headed back in the house by myself so I'm not really keen on this idea right now but I want to do the spirit box for y'all that was just me tripping over some vines. And I'm going to go in here and pray that I make enough noise that the rats will not bother me. All right, little rats. See, I come by here a while ago, and I totally missed this hallway. I'm getting a weird feeling right here, guys. the bathtub.
<coughs> really don't like being in here by myself. Now, I was going to go upstairs and do the spirit box, but I think I'm going to stay down here. Because I don't trust myself going upstairs. So, give me just a second. Let me get that on. Hey. I thought you were upstairs. I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't go up there because I was scared of rats. So, I snuck back here. I thought she was going upstairs. She scared me. Hell out of me. <laughs> sorry. weird I don't know it just started getting all staticky and then yeah, it just that. cut off really I mean strange. it strange I was sitting in here trying to do the meter um, just to see if I get any spikes off of this did and you get anything not yet I'm, I'm sorry that get... lights blown no, okay I was hoping I'd get something in here while I was in the bathroom yeah I don't know I'm kind of scared to turn it back on now but yeah. Is this where you died? You can make my meter spike up and tell me if you if it was. Oh wow. Ooh. Right when I touched it. I'm trying to hold it because you can push the hold button and get the spike right when it does it. Mm-hmm. Aren't moving, but the alarm is going off on it. That's weird. That is weird. Right when I, like, right when I get by this hub. Is 
Just play outside because I hear somebody walking out there. I thought he was. Like I just heard uh, somebody walking out there. Clay. Is Clay out there with you? Huh? Is Clay out there? Yes, he is. He's out there with your mom. I just heard somebody heard out here. Out here. Heather heard somebody out around this side. That's what we heard. We're Did you hear it? I was in the bathroom and just trying to get spikes on my meter and I heard somebody out that win window over there walking around. That's where the noise we heard come from. It's all by that back bathroom. Wow. That's where my speaker box, box just went completely off the chain. And what's really weird is my meter that I'm using, the alarm will go off on it, but it's not giving me a spike every time I touch the tub, the tub with it. Every time the alarm beeps, but no numbers go up. I've never seen it do that before. I, yeah, it's some crazy st And I heard little kids talking on the spirit box. Wow. I can't wait to get back and see what, you know, we may have picked up on the footage. Yeah. And back around that way is where Heather and Clay and Patty all heard the footsteps. Further in the house, so I didn't really get to hear it, but I thought it was play outside, but no, we were right there. It was I'm way over there, there, and you can't walk back there anyway because there's no. trees everywhere. Like, you can't even get back. I had there. just told him, too, I heard something back there as I was doing the spirit box session. That's right. why I came out here, yeah, because yeah. you heard someone back there. Oh my God. That's where they saw the figure last time. And every time I touch this on the tub, it goes, the alarm goes off. That's yes. cool. That's and I never got a chance to really use this inside of a place yet. It's still kind of here and there doing it. Were you in there with when my spirit box went crazy? No, I wasn't in there. Was it was doing right fine. There. Heather heard it was doing fine. And then all of a sudden it kind of like would stretch out the staticky noise on it. Oh, wow. And then it got to where all it did was the static, and I couldn't get it turned off. I had to actually unplug the speaker box from the speaker to yeah. get it to shut it down just, the like, speaker. Went crazy on her, like just out of nowhere. But I was getting kids talking on the spirit Did box. Were, it sounded like kids cool. to me, you yeah. know. I can't wait to hear that. Yeah. <laughs> now you caught all that on camera with your spirit box and everything. Yeah. Okay, everybody, make sure you go check her video out. So you can see yep, I did. <laughs> all right guys well i think that's about it for the drowning house um i'm gonna go home edit this and see what i got and hopefully it'll be some good footage that we'll all enjoy and uh, i really do appreciate all you guys being here to all my new subscribers thank you so much i appreciate that it just seems like the channel's growing and I just don't know how to tell y'all thank you enough, so thank you. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. If you do, like, subscribe, and do all that YouTube stuff. And until the next road trip, much love. Bye, guys.